All right, it's been a hot minute since the last race report. Uh, so here's what I've been up to. I did the Moolumba Cycling Club road race. Jumped in A grade to fill the field and ended up getting third just because I was the third athlete after getting dropped. The week later, I did the Moolumba Cycling Crit Championships and got third after a hard-earned breakaway. Had a solid couple of weeks of training leading into Byron. Uh, try with some run, bike. Uh, training's going good. Really excited to see how I feel. And I'm moving really well in the gym, so I was super, super keen. Except the next day, I ended up with a bit of a sniffles, this lingering head cold that lasted from about Tuesday to Friday. Woke up not feeling the best and figured that I'd just see how I go on the day. Running into the water, I could feel the fatigue because we went up the beach a little bit to avoid the sweep. Tried to stay with Nat the whole time. Uh, figured because he's a super strong swim biker, um, I'd just hang on and see how I go. Only thing was that I lost his feet basically straight away. Then once we were on the bike, there was a well big done, gap, got way too nine. big for me to bridge across, and especially in the super wet technical conditions and packed course, way too many athletes on the field at once. Well done, Travis. I also managed to drop all of my nutrition starting the bike, so I held my own pace and kind of settled it down. But felt really good on the run. Ended up averaging about 3.20 pace for most of the run. Built into it and was really comfortable nose breathing my way through. So I was pretty confident I was in great form leading into the next run race, which is 30K. Recovering well and then moving well back in the gym as well. Super pumped to see how I go in this one. Wanted to average 3.45 after averaging 3.53 at uh, the Rabina one. So I figured why not have a crack. On the starting line, I saw Kyle and Rinny and was checking out to see what pace they were going to do. Kyle said 3.30s and I said no thanks. But Rinny um, was super excited to do 3.45 so I figured I'd just try and pace off her. But it was actually a really sick and really well run event. Um, parked at SeaWorld, rode in, everything was well organised, well marked and it was a really fun vibe. As you can kind of see, there's like thousands of athletes running, which got a little busy on course, but it was good fun. Felt really good. Um, I tapered this time, so my legs weren't too sore, which helped a lot. Uh, trying to hold back quite a bit on the first lap, so I ran at 3.45, paced off a few guys, but as we hit the trails, everyone kind of fell apart, and I ended up finding myself solo for the second lap and decided, hey, why not, let's just run really good and see what happens so looking good Trav. i ended up only 13 seconds slow in the second lap and now we're here recovering well and on to the next race weekend which will be the cooler classic 5k ocean swim uh definitely going to wear a wetsuit so if elites aren't allowed the wetsuit i'm dropping back into age group race and then on the sunday we've got the charles coin 100 kilometer uh cycling race and see how i go there hopefully get some more podiums and see where it takes me